After they were brought down to the police station, they were fingered, booked, and what have you, and I came down to secure their release under $100 bond each. And everything had gone smooth. Uh, they were supposed to have been released about 11.30, and they said they would be up there another hour. So we went to get a cup of coffee uh, and came returned about 12.15. When we returned, we were informed that the bond was now $10,500 each. And uh, we then learned that uh, they stated here that the brothers attacked then. But uh, upon talking with the brothers, we found that they had been viciously set upon and attacked and beaten by the police department here. And uh, then they were then sent to the hospital, the greatest hospital, and, and, and being brought back, they were beat again uh, viciously and inhumanly, kicked about the body, kicked in the ribs, and uh, beaten about the head uh, in the elevator up to the top floor and back. Then they were put into their individual cells. Yeah, one, two. Yeah, we're okay. Okay, James. Mr. Shaw, what happened here last night? Arrested the brothers illegally for defending themselves. And, uh, various guards and things came in and said that uh, the brothers would not be able to live through tonight, uh, which is scheduled to come up before the court tomorrow. And uh, in the police station, they were beat with um, uh, crowbars, sledgehammers, and hacksaws. Uh, the brothers were. The police say that the brothers beat the officers with these things. Is this true? Um, no, sir. The brothers only, we're only taught to defend ourselves. We've had a record here in Atlanta as well as throughout the country being a people of peace. We're taught never to be the aggressor against anyone. But if anyone attacks us, we're taught to defend ourselves. We have lived uh, in the community for 36 years, or, or in, in America for 36 years. And we've never gone around attacking people. We believe in peace, and, uh, but this is another one of those incidents. Yes, sir. What plan of action do you, what plan of action will you take against the police department? Well, we have formed a, a, a form, lodged a formal complaint with the FBI department and also the Department of Justice, Washington, D.C. And uh, we expect to be in court with our attorneys. We are legally represented by an attorney. Now I need to get some. <laughs> Don't nod mine. What action do you plan to take against the Atlanta Police Department? Again. What started the incident here last night? To your knowledge, has Stokely Carmichael ever participated in the sales of the Muslim newspaper? Uh, in as much as he is a subscriber, a reader, I'm sure that he circulates it among his friends.